Hey y'all! So this video was requested, so I want to thank the, the subscriber for requesting this video on how I do my no heat Bantu knot out. So my hair has been freshly washed and conditioned and I've already put a part on the side. Now I'm going to take this twist right here and I'm going to begin to thoroughly comb through my hair just to make sure that there aren't any knots or tangles. Now I'm going to add my Shea Moisture Curl Enhancing Smoothie and I'm just going to work that all into this section just to make sure that my hair is soft even after it's dry. And I'm also going to be using my Eco Styler Gel and I'm going to work that into the section as well just for hold for my Bantu knots so that they won't fall so easily. Now I'm going to begin to section my hair. And I'm going to make medium sized sections for these Bantu knots. So I'm going to split this front section into half. And I'm going to begin to twist the hair onto itself. And I'm going to wrap the hair around at the root to create the knot. And if for any reason the hair becomes untwisted, I'm going to just twirl it around my finger and continue to wrap it around at the root to create the rest of the bantu knot. Again, I'm going to take the hair and I'm going to twist it onto itself and then I'm, begin, I'm going to begin to wrap it around at the root and for any part of the hair that's not twisted, I'm just going to twirl it around my finger and then I'm going to wrap the rest around at the root to create the rest of the bantu knot. Now I'm going to continue this process throughout my entire head. Bye. 
So now that all of my bantu knots are completed, I'm gonna let them air dry as much as they can. And then when the nighttime comes, I'm just gonna scarf it up and get ready for bed. So now my hair is completely dry and I just find the little tails and I begin to unravel the bantu knot all the way around. And I'm gonna do this all around my head. I just find the little tails and then I begin to unwrap the hair to unravel the bantu knot. Now in order to create some volume, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the individual sections and I'm going to begin to split them in into half to create more sections so that my curls are big and voluminous. All right, you guys, this is the finished look. This is how I complete my defined heatless Bantu knot out. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and make sure that you share this video on Facebook and on Twitter if you did enjoy this video. Give it a big thumbs up and also if you would like to see a tutorial or if you have any questions for me, you guys just leave them in the comment section down below. And I see you guys in the next video. Peace and love, y'all. Natural hair clan DIY gang worn shoes crew. <laughs>